Hey guys, it's Marisa. Welcome back to my channel. How is everyone today? So today, what are we doing? All right, so I don't know. I mean, I, I meant so many people have done this before, but I really want to just use these beautiful paints. And I was thinking of sunsets and the colors that you could possibly get in a sunset. Now, I don't know what sunset this is that has all these colors, but you do get some sunsets that have like pinks and purples, of course, there's oranges and reds. And what I did do is I actually mixed very unique colors together, especially the pink. Okay, so I am using my beautiful Primal Flow acrylics again today, and I'm going to show you in a second how this one dried. Okay, so, and I am going to do a waterfall pour, um, or if they call it gravity pour. I haven't done one in a while, um, and I'll link the one that I did right here. Okay, so I think I did a couple on this channel. Uh, but my last one, people seem to really, you guys seem to really like it. And thank you so much for that. So, the colors we have today are Sunshine. We got the Glam Red. We have the Bubblegum Pink. We have a little bit of Champagne. Nothing wrong with a little Champagne in the morning. And then we have Plum Perfect. So, the unique colors... So we have the Plum Perfect. Okay, now this pink here, I wanted to like experiment a little, mix a little bit together. You know, a lot of times now, um, I just use these colors straight out of the bottle and I don't mix anymore and I let the colors mix together when I'm pouring. But, you know, I'm an artist. I've been an artist my whole life. I'm like, mix the colors, Marisa. Maybe you'll get, you know, you can get some nice unique colors. So I did. Uh, the bubblegum pink actually has a little bit of the champagne that was left over from yesterday. And I didn't want to go to waste, so I add a little champagne in there. And then I add a couple of drops of the Plum Perfect. So this is a pretty, very pretty pink. Very light and bright for our sunset. And then the Glam Red is just the Glam Red. And then what I did was the Sunshine... Um, I added a little bit of the Glam Red to the Sunshine, so it, was, it has a little bit more of an orangey um, feel to it, but still bright like the pure yellow. And then, <clears throat> excuse me, I added, sorry the bottle is filthy, um, what else is new with me? This is the um, Primal Flow Cell Tastic Pour Oil. So there is two drops, one to two drops in each of these beautiful colors. And then I finally figured out what that said. It is burnished brass glitter. I really couldn't see that word. I'm like, what does that say? Because I'm assuming it was gold, but it's brass. So... When I mixed that unicorn um, glitter in my last uh, painting, it really didn't show up in here, and I'll show you in a second. Um, it didn't show up because it was mixed in the paint, okay? So I should have just added a little bit afterwards, but I didn't want to like touch it. I just, I just love the painting so much. But so this shows a little bit. I'm gonna put a little bit of this um, uh, burnished brass glitter um, after I pour and just in the little in very specific spots I'm not gonna douse the whole painting in glitter just you know I'll see how the painting comes out after and then I will choose like a little spot to just add a little glitter just to experiment a little and see what it looks like okay all right so let me show you really quick okay how this beautiful um, painting came out. It, I'm telling you, these paints are really fantastic. It dries beautifully. I mean, it's more of a matte, it is not glossy. But the colors don't get darker. They don't 
fade. It's not like I have to add so much white to it where like um, these colors like stay more, stay brighter. It just literally dried exactly the way I left it. It's absolutely fantastic, this paint. I can't, I really can't um, tell you how happy I am with it. You know, it's just amazing. So, oh yes, and I forgot to mention in these paints here, there I did not add any pouring medium. The only pouring medium, because I did use the champagne from yesterday and that little tub there, there is the regular uh, Primal Flow pouring medium in that, but I just add a little bit to this pink, okay? So there is a little bit of um, pouring medium in that particular color, otherwise there is no pouring mix. I just wanted to try it without it because honestly it is, see that? It's fluid. It's, it's fluid. You don't really need pouring medium, okay? Um, I don't know why they actually make them, but like I said, you don't, and if you do use the pouring medium, just literally, whew, just like, just enough to cover the bottom of like, let's say whatever container you're using, just like a little bit, maybe half of that, just like a very thin coating on the bottom, that is more than enough. You don't need a lot, which is great, because then a, a little bit goes a long way. And actually these paints in general, a little bit goes a long way. I'm thinking always that I don't, I don't have enough paint. When I have more than enough, I always have extra. So just letting you guys know that. So yeah, so this dried just amazing. I just love it. It's just amazing. I can't tell you how happy I am with these paints. Not sponsored, though I definitely should be because I would be their biggest fan, you know, really. Um, yeah, it's just wonderful. No texture. The only texture is from the glitter um, that did not show up. I, I don't know if you could see the texture. See those little bumps? That's like from the glitter um, that, like I said, did not show up, but that's fine. Otherwise, it's just perfectly dried exactly the way I left it. This very cool movement in here it's just amazing i love it anyway enough about me raving about this paint let's go on so i can rave more about the paint after okay um so oh say good morning it is the morning so we are going to use another 12 by 12 uh canvas and we are going to do a, a waterfall pour and say hi to my coffee without coffee i am no good i love me some coffee all right so let's get started and i will see you guys in a second we'll do the pour all right
Hey guys, I am back. So I just wanted to show you something really uh, that I found interesting. So without the pouring medium, this uh, was not obviously not as fluid. That makes sense. Um, and there wasn't any like mixing of colors really, which actually this time I was actually looking for because you know like more of a sunset, but. And this looks nothing like a sunset. Sunset colors, okay. <laughs> but, um, yeah, what I did do was, off camera, I just added a little more paint in each section. So it would become a little more fluid. And then, what I did get was some pretty cool cell uh, production here. Not too much, which is good because sometimes it can be overwhelming with cells and it's like wow it, all it is is cells um if that's what you're looking for that's great but i didn't want it to be like crazy crazy cells and i did add that glitter i hope that you could see that glitter um yeah there there you go you could see that now the burnished brass glitter which is right here yeah, so these colors are gorgeous. I do like the way this came out. Like I said, I add just a little more um, paint to each section, section so it would be more fluid. And then I just, um, you know, I tipped it again. I just, um, and the only reason why I torched it again off camera is because I added more paint. And I, you know, if there was any bubbles, but they're really there aren't any bubbles in this paint it's just wonderful there you go there's a nice close-up of the cells and the glitter i was just going to add it to one little section but um i as usual i got excited i went crazy but i think it looks pretty just a little bit all over not just one section but i just want to show you the difference see of with pouring medium you get this kind of course this is a different type of pour as well different technique but that is more what you get with the pouring medium that is the metallic medium and the regular pouring medium and this is with no, no medium except for in that one color which was the um the pink with a little bit of champagne right there so that's the difference so that is what I wanted to show you today. And yeah, that's it for today. But I just want to remind you guys that I do have a, um, a giveaway. So if you want to check that out, I will link yesterday's video there. And if you are interested in my Lunar New Year uh, giveaway, go over to that video and you can comment on that video. Okay, you just have to comment and enter me. Just go to that video for now, okay? So don't forget, if you are interested, we have three, uh, if you want to call the contestants, okay, so far, and that is exciting. All right, guys, so I hope you love this pour. I love the way it came out. The paints, the colors are gorgeous. I'm very happy with it. Um, yeah, so I am happy. So listen guys, that is it for today. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.